These new easy goes take a lot less gas. <laughs> Every day, Golf Cart Garage gets calls and emails just like this one. John's email says, Hey Dave, every time my golf cart hits a bump, <laughs> my soul leaves my body. How do I get a smoother ride? So it's time for Ask Dave right now on GCG TV. Hey, welcome back to the Golf Cart Garage, and thanks for joining us, as today we'll be looking into a smoother ride because of all the questions we get about this on our phones and email. And this subject can vary quite a bit depending on your specific cart and condition, so today we're just going to cover some general, universal basics. But if you have questions on your own vehicle that we don't cover, just get in touch. We handle diagnosis, tech help, parts, and more, all online at golfcartgarage.com, and we're always happy to help. We've got an electric golf cart here on set today because we care about the planet. I mean, that's where I keep all my stuff. But ride quality is essentially the same for both gas and electric carts. So here are some of the factors that we see the most. First, suspension. If you have a rough ride, inspect your shocks and the leaf springs for damage, play, or heavy rust. Over time, these parts can wear out. It's also important to have a look at the bushings to ensure that old age or damage isn't causing metal-on-metal -metal contact. This can also affect your ride. Next up, tires. And first, tire tread. We see a lot of commuters and paved surface drivers using all-terrain tires. Changing up to a street tread can really help. Next is tire height. It's just physics. A larger tire has more surface area to take a bump more smoothly. I'd rather hit a rock riding a bicycle than on a skateboard. It may require lifting your cart, but a taller tire can give better ride comfort. Next is sidewall to wheel ratio. Low profile tires look super cool, but a smaller wheel with the same tire height means more sidewall. The more rubber that meets the road, the smoother the ride. Next up, tire pressure. Inflating your tires to max PSI will usually have them rounded and overinflated. Every tire and driving style is different, but sometimes adjusting your tire pressure down will give a more comfortable ride. And next, lift kits. Sometimes a lift kit can take a while to break in, and some of them are just stiff by nature. But long travel kits, well, they cost more, but have adjustments that other kits don't to allow you to find the sweet spot in your ride and they usually allow for the most increase in tire size if you want an extreme makeover. Hopefully our little crash course here helps you find your best ride quality. But if you need help with your specific cart, just get in touch. You can get diagnosis, tech help, parts, accessories, and more at golfcartgarage.com. Or give us a call at 1-800-401-2934 so we can help show you around the garage. And hey, while you're here, Give us a like and hit that subscribe button for more episodes. Thanks for watching GCGTV.